Welcome back to CNH Farms. Today we are going to be spreading some slurry and then afterwards we'll just do a little bit of manure spreading. So we're just getting done cleaning off the 8R410 with the pressure washer. Uh, it's looking pretty good. Uh, tuned it up a little bit so it should be running really nice for this. So we're going to drive over to the slurry where that tank is and we're going to fill up then on slurry. So we got the slurry spreader. This thing is uh, very heavy, huge, so that's so why we got such a big tractor with triples and duals on it. So our first field is just right here across the road. So let's start spreading. All right. So I made quite the mistake, we forgot to put the distributor on the back, so now we got the right equipment on. So now we can actually start getting rid of some of the slurry, so there we go. Now we probably should be using a bigger tractor, it's usually hard to tell. But I mean, it's looking, it's looking fine with this one. It's, I think it's just about right. And that's about it for the first load. Uh, and we are out, so we're going to fold this up, um, and then we're going to get a lot more. Takes a while to fold, so we'll see you when we get more. Pulling up to the south farm here, uh, this slurry has not been emptied in a while, so going to expect a lot out of this one for sure. So we didn't get much overall, which I'm not really surprised. It's, it's. I mean, we're really just trying to get rid of all the slurry and manure, so we're uh, just spending a little bit on this field too. We got uh, pretty much the headlands on the other field. This one, we're definitely not going to get headlands, but we'll just get a little row here. It, it, we're just really trying to get rid of it, so it doesn't, doesn't really matter a ton on how much we get. It's just... It's just a pretty simple thing. And that's it. We're already out. So we're going to go get the manure spreader. So we got the manure spreader here. Very small one because we really do not spread that much manure. But we have the manure pile back here behind here. This is just one of the smaller, uh, just one of the smaller pens. So not much manure out of this one. But we definitely got a lot more on the other farm. So let's grab a skid steer and start uh, putting some manure in there. Not a skid steer, I said the wrong type of machinery, but it's a case. Pretty old one. Uh, we got a bucket on there, but don't need don't need uh, anything that big for this job. So. out there there we go that's full bucket and let's dump this in There we go, that's the first bucket. Uh, we'll see how much we get out of this. Probably not too much. That's the last bucket from there. So not much from there. But we're going to head over to the other one. Get some more from there. And then we also have another... On the south farm we have a little manure there too. So don't expect a full trailer. But... We'll see how close we can get. That's the last bucket from there. So now to the south farm. And that is it for all the manure. Um, so not that much because we, we did empty it a couple, couple weeks ago. But we're just going to spread it on a field and then we'll be done. 
And here's the field, so let's unfold this thing first, make sure everything's looking all good. Very dangerous spot to stand, but let's get up here. If we can, I'll just use the ladder over here. Whoops. Oh yeah, we got justice. Okay, that actually is good. I'm gonna leave that. Okay. It looks good. So, we can start here. This is probably gonna barely even touch the field. Because there's not much in here, but let's start it. There we go. There's some, uh, there's a little bit of a newer. Not much at all, but it's good to just get rid of this stuff. Don't even really care how much we uh, spread here, but mainly getting the headlands, at least on my farm, is where yield is not the best just because it's the headlands and a lot of rain, a lot of everything just gets piled up there and the soil's just not as good, especially by the road because all that, uh, all the traffic. But around here, since there's a river there, we get a lot of sediment that gets washed up and it, sometimes it floods too, so this has not always been the best spot. But spread a little manure, gets a little better. And that's literally it. That is all. So that's that's it. Thank you guys for watching CNH Farms and we'll see you in the next one.